Peyton, thank you. In developing now, teachers in Mason are planning to rally after more than five months of contract negotiations. The most recent union contract expired last month. The Mason Education Association says they still haven't agreed on a new contract with the district as school is about to begin. Jordan Veline joins us live in studio with the details on where things stand. Good morning, Jordan. Good morning. So the union says that they're currently fighting for more competitive pay. They're also fighting for more development days, among other types of support for teachers there. According to research by our partners over at the Cincinnati Enquirer, Mason City Schools actually falls within the state's top 10 highest paying school systems. But many teachers within that district still say they feel undervalued and underpaid. So on Monday, the group's bargaining team, they're going to start another round of discussion with the Board of Education. During those talks, teachers plan to actually rally outside of the Mason Central office in support of a fair contract. So if the union and school district do not reach an agreement by next week, it is possible that teachers will start the school year without a contract. The first day back to school for some Mason students, that's going to be August 15th, according to the district's website. Now that walk and rally, that's planned to begin at 11 a.m. Monday, starting at Mason Middle School and ending at the district's central office where union reps will meet with the school board for more mediations. For now, live in studio, Jordan Valines, Fox 19 Now.